application Close Iron a warehouse application to remove the winker by using the combination of heat and the pressure When the iron is turned on, the consumer moves it over an item of closed iron uh, ironing board The history and the type of iron The first generation is the metal pan filled with the cork coal It's made in the China by 1st century And the second one is the set iron or uh, we call it flat iron Begin to use from the 17th century Things like or cast iron, data shape and heat in the fire And the third one is the gas iron Available in America in the late 1800 It was hooked up by the line gas and contain the burner The fourth one is electric iron Inventor in the 1800 hook up the electric source by detachable wire But it did not have a electric cord And the next one is electric, electric iron with the electric cord It is invented in 1903 And the next one is electric iron adding automatic heat control Introduced in 1920 And the last one is the steam iron It is available in the 1926 Easy to move a dry fabric I will, I will would like to talk about the operating procedure. First, preparing to iron. Make sure that the garment is meant to be ironed. Second step, set up the ironing area. Use an ironing board if possible. The ironing board is designed to absorb heat and moisture without taking damage. Make sure that you don't iron on a highly flammable surface. Third step, fill the water reservoir of the iron. If your iron features a steam function, then you may need to add water. Make sure that you use filter water to avoid calcium buildup in your iron. Fourth step, lay out the garment. Arrange the clothing so that it lies perfectly on the board. Fifth step is heat up the iron. Turn the iron dial to the setting that is most suitable to your fabric so that fabric will not be damaged. See? Iron the first side of the fabrics. Run the hot first side of the iron firmly and smooth out the wrinkle. Seven smooth out the other side and lastly hang the cloth immediately after ironing. Okay. Alright, uh, for my part, I will just about the pattern of ironing. There are three points. First point, appearance. We will lose water in iron clothes. Second point, protect the clothes. It prevents contact with fluoride used in dry cleaning. Third point, a lacing experience. It can be a lacing and framing task to undertake. Okay, we go to the, the next topic. It's about advantage in thermodynamics. First, the iron will not overheat by using a temperature thermostat. Temperature thermostat is used to control the temperature. Next part, the thermodynamic principle will prevent hazard from happening, so it's more safety. The last one is thermodynamic system can save our electricity. Thermodynamic is the branch of physics concerned with heat and temperature and their relation to energy and work. Thermodynamics consists of three laws. First law of thermodynamics, second law of thermodynamics, and third law of thermodynamics. The electric iron is in first law of thermodynamics. Electric iron works with temperature control. By utilizing parameter technology, it can detect certain temperature, which is when the temperature is too high or too low. Thermodynamics one, which of course in iron is that the energy used is transformed into heat energy but magnitude remains constant. The first law of thermodynamics states that energy cannot be created and destroyed but can only be transformed into. Hello everyone, now I would like to present about the part of how people live before the iron clock was invented. First of all, we will discuss about the country. Eastern country, the eastern country such as China, they were using hot metal to iron their clothes. And the hot metal they were using such as pan, and they were filling with the hot coal to 
and press on their clothes to remove the stress. Next, for Northern Europe, they were using stone, glass, and wood to smooth their clothes. During the process, water may apply, but if compared to using heat, using its heat is better. As a conclusion, thermodynamics is considered to be one of the most important things in our life. This is because thermodynamics was applied in our life almost every day, either directly or indirectly. And that's all for our presentation. Thanks for watching.